Hello everyone, welcome back to the Gaming Flow. In this video, we're going to talk about how to fix Dave the Diver is having an issue with controller or the gamepad is not working on your PC and how you can fix this up. So let's dive into this. The first one is all about you have to start with updating the game. So if you're having any kind of updates here, you can update the game and you can see whether the issue is solved or not. If after updating the game, the issue is still persisting, then we have to move to the next one. That is nothing but what it does. You just need to disable Steam input. For disabling the Steam input, we have to go over here, right click and go to properties. Now from here, go to controller. Now from here, you can see this will be like use default settings. Click on this one. First, set this to disable Steam input. Try launch the game. If disabled Steam input is not working, try with enabling the Steam input and try launching the game. Most probably, any one of the things has to be worked. Most probably for most, most users, when they set this to, from the use default setting, when they change this to use this Steam input, disable the Steam input, it did work out for them. So you can try this and any one of the things has to be worked. Next one is nothing but you can launch the Steam in the big picture mode and launch the game. For many users, this did work out as well. So I'm going to show you this. The big picture mode o is over here. If you click at the top on this one, you will be entering into big picture mode. So just click over here at the top. Now you just need to wait so that it will be entering like this. So once you enter the big picture mode, next is you have to. Now from here, you just need to go over here in the game. That is, this is the game. So just click on this game. Now from here, click on the play button and try launch the game. This is what you have to do. For most of the users, when they launch the game in the big picture mode, this did work it and most issues regarding this has to be sorted out. So you can try with this. Next one is nothing but you wanted to exit the big picture mode. Just go over here in the menu. Now from here, go to uh, go over here in the power now from here will be getting an option exit big picture mode so just click on this one so now you are back with the steam and you can go to the library now from here in the library you can go to the day of the diver and you can launch the game this is what you have to do next one is nothing but always try using wired connection that is for many i mean we use wired controller this did work out for many users so you can try this out so always use wired controller did work out for many users so you can try this out as well Next one is nothing but you can try with those who, who are using the PS5 controllers. They can install or try PS4 uh, as well as ReWASD on your game and you can try with this. If that is not working, those who are on the Xbox controller, they need to install the Xbox accessory app from the Microsoft Store. For this, just go over here in the search over here and go to Microsoft Store. Now from here, click on the Microsoft Store. Now from here, once you enter into the Microsoft Store, you need to search for the ins Xbox app. That is a very important one. You have to search for Xbox Accessories app. You have to search for Xbox Accessories app. Just search for Xbox Accessories app. So if it's not installed, you can get it on your PC. You can download this and connect the controllers. You'll be having, when you open this, you'll be having an option to update the controller. So just update the controller. You have to update your uh, Xbox controller. Once after that, go back and try launch the game. Next one is nothing but for many users, when they did this, it did work out for them. That is nothing but most of us might be connected with, you know, multiple, uh, you know, we'll be having parallel such as mouse, joystick, anytime. Sometimes we might be connected with HOTAS, wheels, Logitech wheels, etc. on our PC or laptop. Remove everything from here. Just remove everything. Launch the game. Once game is successfully launched, you have to connect back the controllers. If you wanted to play the game with the mouse, just connect back the mouse and try launching the game. I don't know how this is related, but this did work out for most, many of the users. I found this, many users shared this in the Steam community forum, as well as many users mentioned this in the Reddit. So this did work out for them, so you can try this out as well. So these are the possible workaround which you have to try out when you are having an issue with Dave the Driver. The controller or gamepad is not working and how you can fix this up and i hope this video is helpful and if you find this video helpful don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for more these kind of videos see you soon in the next video bye bye